Anika Mukan. Welcome back to the Nigeria Centenary Camp. Now, a well-rounded centenary queen should be a force to be reckoned with in every aspect of her life. She should shine as she goes out into the world, as well as in her own home. Now, a sure way to win the hearts of everyone in the household is in the kitchen. To that end, we brought in our special guest from Maggie to test your culinary skills. So please help me welcome Chef Punshak. Welcome. How are you doing? Great. Hi, ladies. Hi. Good day. It's nice to meet you again in this camp. You're welcome to my, uh, Maggie Challenge, Cooking Challenge. Today, tax is, as you all know, the Maggie Cooking Challenge. And the expectation in here is that we need to see you translate the beauties in your faces into the dish. And that interesting. Maggie said, every woman is a? Star. Every woman is a? Star. And that's why we're here, to be able to see and test your culinary abilities in here in this challenge. And today, as this challenge goes up, we have some criteria guiding us in this. But before then, you have the baggages that's in the front. These are gifts from Maggie to you. You can just check them and then see, these are gifts from you from Maggie. Okay, as we go on, we have one hour 30 minutes to run up this challenge. And groups, participants are grouped into the six political zones and you are expected to cook the dish from the geopolitical zone which you come from. And it's a two course meal. It's either a starter or a main dish or a dessert and a main dish, whatsoever way you desire. So you're going to be brainstorming to be able to come up with these dishes. Criteria that we're going to be using to judge for to be able to get the people that give us the best performance, to be able to bring the best of their culinary skills, will be taste and balance. We need to be able to make sure that your food tastes excellently, because for us, Maggie, taste is key in every cooking. Second, we're looking at balance. And also appearance. How do you appear when you go to important functions? How do you blend your colors? So we need to see that translated into your place. We also want to see your creativity and originality. Something, a twist, just something, just a twist. We need to see that creativity. We need to see strong creativity and also presentation. Presentation is key because I know you have presented yourself beautifully well today. And we want to see that translate to the dish that you're going to be cooking today. And now we shall be going to the market to do your purchasing. That is the reason why you're going to brainstorm to be able to come up with the menu you're going to be cooking and also make your market list to be able to make sure that you get all of the things that you needed in the market. And I want to also tell you, freshness is key in buying and also good pricing is also key. If a sum of 5,000 Naira will be given to you for your purchasing and you are expected to cook for four. And in the next two, four, three minutes, as you brainstorm, we shall be going to the market for our purchasing. So, you brainstorm ladies. I wish you good luck. Team leader, here is 5,000 Naira to go to the market and complete your task. Good luck. Thank you. Hello, team leader. Here is 5,000 Naira to go to the market and complete your task. You're welcome. Good luck. Here is 5,000 Naira to go to the market. Here is 5,000 Naira to go to the market. Here is 5,000 Naira to go to the market and complete your task. Here is 5,000 Naira to go to the market and complete your task. All right, ladies, you've now received your money. It's time to go to the market. The bus is right behind us, so let's go. My name is Rabi Hassan and I'm representing Adamawa State, 
which is the land of beauty. I'm a positive thinker and I like to surround myself with positive people and positive energy. I do not like and condone any form of negativity. I love challenges a lot and I have a great survival instinct. I can very much do well in any situation. My friends think I have a bubbly personality where well, you see for yourself. Thank you. Hi, my name is Uba Queen Amarachi. I am Miss Imo for Nigeria Centenary Pageant. I am a graduate of University of Illinois, Quara State. I read geology. I'm a fun person. I love having my family around most times. I believe that being a better person, you have to have family and close one around, respect and value relationship to even be a better Nigerian. Thank you. I believe in the fact that we should retain our values and our value system, which is our heritage, even as we grow as a nation. Daluno. My name is Oyaluna Bless Nodufa. I'm Miss Lagos. I love to organize, and my unit has won an award for the most organized unit in the fellowship. I love to meet people, browse, and make people happy. I love exploring and doing anything good that will end me something. Thank you. Hello, everyone. My name is Polisho Adewaro, and I represent Miss Diaspora. On a serious note, I'm a goal oriented person, an idealist, and I'm very focused. On a lighter note, I like hanging out with friends, cracking jokes, I like traveling and I like fun. On a general note, I like to be a part of anything that would make me a better person. Thank you. Hello everyone, my name is Clement Crow Oinden for Justina. I'm Miss Viosa and I'm here in the Miss Nigeria Centenary pageant. I love sit up. I've done 100 sit up and I've also swim across my river in the village. Thank you. Hello viewers, my name is Priscilla. I'm one of the Nigerian Centenary Pageants. I'm representing Miss Kirby. My hobbies is I like singing, dancing, listening to music and traveling. I'm strong, I'm brave, I'm fearless. And most of all, I'm Miss Kirby. Thank you. My name is Ruth Cobham. I come from Cross River State. I love singing. I can sing your pain away. I love cooking. Cooking is my hobby. I cook good. I also love being around people, making new friends, socializing, and also would really love to help the younger ones grow. Thank you very much. Hello, Nigeria. My name is Nkemka Onokoro. I'm Miss Eboyin. I'm in Abia State University, studying geoplanning in 300 level. I love cooking. My best soup is Italian soup, and I bet you, if I cook it for you, you're gonna pay me. I don't mind selling a plate like 3,000 naira. I love traveling too. I've been to lots of places. I like meeting people. I like making friends. I like people that encourages me, people that inspires me. I always like being cheerful because you never can tell. I like accommodating people too. Thank you. Hi everyone. My name is Anna Gwajalumi Akpala. I am a 400 level medicine and surgery student of the University of Potakot. I am Miss Akwaibom. I am 22 years old and I am a native of Delta State. I speak English, Hausa and Igbo languages fluently. I love to play basketball, I love dancing, I love reading, I love to learn. I am a nice and friendly person. I believe in myself and also in God. Thank you. Hello good people of Nigeria. I'm Chirima Obasi, Miss Kanu. I'm 20 years old, a 300 level student of marketing department at Boeing State University. I love meeting people, I love acting, dancing. I'm very emotional actually. I love encouraging people and motivating people. Thank you very much.
sometimes alone in the morning I look outside my window I recall the joy that brought us together Then the struggle began for freedom from slavery Our voices cried out, cried out for freedom I heard our voices from a distance All in confusion All we wanted was our hearts to beat as one For independence We saw high like the people Spirit and soul together To create a nation with no fear I am a Nigerian Not just meant to non-violent Peaceful and serene I am the Nigerian dream Wow, it's a great time today. Aren't you happy, guys? <laughs> From the market, to the cooking, to the washing, to the peeling, to all of that. For me, I, I caught all the fun. But now we're at the crucial time where we need to do our final checks. Before we start, we told you that hygiene, taste, balanced nutrition, Creativity and presentation are the things we shall be looking as you prepare the meals. They are well presented, very nicely looking, color display, good. But now we've got to taste them to find out if they're there. Well, the taste of the pudding is in the eating. <laughs> Thank you. 
Sao. South West, not West. Can you tell us about what you prepared before we go ahead? We, and this is a local house at home. It's mainly for the northerners. It's me and Kubewa and Semovita. So, Saudis. Yes, sir. Can you tell us about what you prepared? Okay, we have two meals, dishes here. We have our appetizer, which is the garden egg, the cola nut, and the peanut butter. And the local, we, from where we come from in Southeast, it's a tradition to serve cola when you visit a guest. It is locally called Oji Na Osoji. Oji Na Osoji. Yes. Wonderful. <laughs> Good. And that is the <laughs> liver, sauce, and the rice. Not central? Yes, sir. Can you tell us about your... Yes, um, this is semovita and obono soup. Yeah, the obono soup was made from the dika nut, which is popularly known as obono seed. And we have um, different kind of fishes in it. We have stock fish, we have dry fish to season the food and make it very, very delicious. Good afternoon. Afternoon. So tell, can you tell us about your meal? Okay, this is the starter. It's called kontombori. And it's Ooh. originally from Adamawa State, which is part of the northeastern states in Nigeria. Kontombori is a very delicious delicacy. It's made from overripe plantain and palm oil and spiced very well with black pepper and other spices. Then this is the main dish, Tuo Semovita and Mi Ankubewa, which is okra soup. South South. <laughs> hey, can we hear about your meal? Um, what we have here today is I made um, catfish pepper soup okay. and idikai kong also alongside with semo with with. So the the catfish pepper soup is made up of um, scent leaf, pepper and we season it properly to taste good as a Canada by woman. <laughs> then we have idikai kong here which is made up of water leaf ugu and we put a lot of rishi rishi inside like pomo meat dried fish and periwinkles for iron this soup is called a foriro and it's usually prepared by the southwestern people of nigeria it's a delicious delicacy that is rich in iron vitamin and proteins and these are the deserts we should take after meal to eat digestion. Thank you. Hi everyone, my name is Ujebe Grace and I'm Miss FCT. I'm a student of University of Benin studying International Studies and Diplomacy. I love singing and I love meeting friends, especially real ones. I would really, really, really love to be Miss Nigeria Centenary Pageant just to help serve Nigeria better. Thank you. Good evening, good people of Nigeria. I'm Divine Ngozi Ibe, a student of Eboy State University, studying English and Literature 100 level. My hobbies are traveling, dancing, and cooking. I was 
The first one I opened was in Nasserawa 2011. I see myself as a woman endured with so many inner beauties. And I believe with your help and support, I'm going to make it big. Thank you very much. Hello, wonderful people of Nigeria. I'm Osadebe Ifeenwa, Ms. Zamfara. I studied economics at Obafemi Awolowo University. I love meeting friends. I love traveling. I love knowing people. I like helping people who have problems. And most importantly, I'm a young lady who loves to impact in people's lives. Thank you. Hi, beautiful people of Nigeria. I'm Ms. Niger, Momo Ilya Jomresi. I'm a 300 level economy student of Kogi State University. I'm a sanguine by nature. I'm partly extrovert and partly intro introverted. I'm an easygoing person. I love to cook, dance, sing, and I'm quite hardworking. I love meeting new people and making new friends. But above all, I love being myself because that's the best I can ever be. Thank you. Hello, beautiful Nigerians. I'm also the taxi Jennifer. I'm 200 level as mass communication student. I'm Miss Nesarawa. Habits are traveling, meeting up to friends. On my birthday, I go to less privileged home to spend my time with them. Thank you. So, Chef Panchak, these Maggie meals were amazing. Yeah. But they yeah. can only be one winner. Sure, sure. And um, you're going to announce who the winner is. Now the sad part about this is um, the losing team is up for eviction. You know, because to be a true centenary queen, you gotta know how yeah, to I cook. Agree, I agree. Okay, so we're going to announce the winners. Sure, sure, sure. Right away. And uh, the team up for eviction. So go ahead. Fifth position comes with two score two hundred and six point. The North Central team. Well done. Then the fourth position comes up with 211 points. Southwest team. So they're safe. So now you are safe. The third position. Comes up with 216 points, quite very close margin. The South South team. The second position comes up with 236 points. The North East team. Good, good. So at this point, can I have the South East and the Northwest team here, please? because only one of them can come first. You have both done an excellent job. The meals were very tasty from all sides, but one of the team had not performed in some areas. The Southeast team, What did you fix? Oh Is that a Nigerian meal? Yes. No, it's a diaspora meal. It's a unifying meal between Nigeria and diaspora. And you think that can be able to give you the first place in this competition? Yes, with our appetizer, which is local and acceptable by all Africans. We shall now see. The Northwest, what can you say? Can I look at your faces and look at the dish you prepare to say what you look is what is in the dish? And the winner for this cooking challenge for the Centenary Pageant 2013 is the Saudi! <laughs> Northwest, you ladies, you did a really great job. You put in all your all, but you know, just came up just a little bit short. 
but um, we will see who will remain with us as we choose the Nigerian Centenary Queen. Thank you. Thank you. Chef Tanshak. Thank you so very much. Fantastic. Yes. It was a pleasure to have you here, and your the Maggie meals looked amazing, and congratulations to Thank you. Thank you so very much. Thank All you right. so much.